G'day, it's Breck here, and here I am once again going through the latest from the Here We Go. So it's the second lot for this week. So it's what I like to call the second day of Orkmas in July. And I'm really excited. I haven't had a, a good look at it yet, but it looks really, really exciting stuff. Before I get into it, you may not be aware of this, but if you're watching right now, then you're most likely not a subscriber. If that's you, all I ask you is please give us a subscribe. It'd be muchly appreciated. And then also hit the notification bell so you can get more of this great stuff that's coming up. Three ways to make wah. Make orcs louder and more dangerous than ever. The Beast Snagger Orcs Army set is up for pre-order this weekend. Yeah, we know that. And it includes a new shiny edition of the Codex. Yeah, we know that. Among the many awesome rules in the book are details of three distinct types of war cry. A war, a speed war, and a great war. You may be tempted to think of them as guttural howls of animalistic fury with zero tactical effect. But no, there are nuances and they give orc armies scary advantages in battle. Now I like this because it seems to be putting squirrel to the myth that orcs are dumb, brutal creatures. They're brutal, but let's not call them dumb. And there's a nice big picture. Wow, there's a lot going on here. Oh, we've got some stompers and some noughts and some of the new Beast Snagger boys and the Morzag. Great White Squig himself and his little riding friend. I like that pick. Calling a Wa. To unleash a thunderous power of a Wa, you need a War Boss or Speed Boss to be your Warlord. They have got the loudest voices, clearly. Your choice here is to determine whether your warlord can call a war or a speed war. And there's a nice picture of a war trike and a couple of bikes. Hmm. Sounds interesting. So you've got two choices. A slow, a slow war or a faster war. I'm not quite sure what this means just yet, but wow, look at this picture. I really, really like this picture. For your warlord Galvasing Warcry to be heard, they need to be on the battlefield during the command phase, or at least embarked on a transport that's on the battlefield. In the latter case, we assume he shoves his head out of window before starting the shouting. A war or a speed war can be called once per battle, and they both work in two stages. Stage one lasts until the start of your next command phase, then stage two kicks in, which lasts until the beginning of your subsequent command phase. Wow, there's a lot there's a lot going on here, but let's just take stock of this. And here's a rule. Wah raising his weapons into the air before gesturing towards the enemy, the war boss bellows his war cry. Every nearby orc joins in before surging towards the enemy. Blades ready in an overwhelming tide. Stage one, call the, call the war. Orcs core and orcs character units from your army are eligible to declare a charge even when they have advanced this turn. Add one to the attacks characteristic of orcs models in your army. Okay, so this is very similar to the old, um, the old, the war of, of, of old. So, Similar sort of thing, you call you call wah means that you can so you can advance then charge. Sounds good. And they add one to the attacks characteristic. That's an old stable too, isn't it? And stage two, get stuck in. Add one to the at all the attacks characteristic of orcs models from your army. So stage one. Stage one lasts until the start of your next command phase. So okay, this is this this is really interesting trying to get my head around this. Stage one lasts until the start of the command phase. It's for the whole, that turn, you call a wah, a charge an attack. If I'm reading this right, not only do you get an add one attack characteristics of the orc model from your 
army in when you've charged you also get it in your opponent's turn if you're um, if you're in combat i assume wow that's that's huge i like that i i think i like this great rule the speed wah as soon as the bullets of the foe whistle past his vehicle the speed boss throws back his head and roars his war cry the call echoing from a ramshackle vehicle following his wake as they surge forward even faster stage one to big race orc models from your army do not suffer the penalty incurred to their hit rolls for firing assault weapons in the same turn their unit advance each time an orc's vehicle or an orc biker model from your army shoots with a dagger weapon make one additional attack with that weapon so each time a model in an orc's vehicle or an orc's biker unit from your army makes a ranged attack improve the armor penetration characteristic by attack by one okay all right there's a there's a lot to, there's a really lots of digest here stage two give them some dagger so each time a model in an orc's vehicle or orc's biker unit from your army makes a ranged attack improve the armor penetration characteristic by attack by one yeah, very similar but to do more to do with with the shooting extra additional attack with with a weapon sounds sounds great with, with a dacker weapon i'm not quite sure what a dacker weapon is but um i'm sure we'll find that out sooner or later a new weapon type wow i'm saying wow like this is this is just blowing my mind and i'm not quite sure what it all means calling a wire at the right time enables your green skin hordes to get crumping much faster then they can advance and charge in the same turn and it gives them more attacks once they get there your speed freak units are fast enough already so unleashing the speed wire gives their ample firepower a boost instead okay jokey the third type of wah the great wah no less is reserved exclusively for the biggest and meanest and nastiest and ugliest but don't tell me we said that war boss and all the beast himself gasgol thracker the great war can also be called once per battle but it combines the effects of both war and speed war making your army faster stronger and shootier all the same time if you don't think the deadliest orc of all could become deadlier still in the new codex the great war is solid proof to the contrary suffice to say that if gasgol has called one in the picture below those poor astra matilla astra matilla, yeah guard soldiers are going to have a very bad day at the office remember that the beast snagger orcs army set complete with the new shot mechanics is up for pre-order this weekend and you can to get ahead you can order gasgol now rah, rah, rah. we've also been listening to the beast of rises we have plenty of rules previews from the rad new edition of codex orcs throughout the week if you want to learn why the green skins are set to become harder and killier than ever before make sure you check back with us every day okay wow so um all right so you got three types of wires it looks like they're trying to make even though beast daggers are a thing um gasgol is still you take gasgol you're gonna get use of the wire and the speed wire which means take gazzy and you have the ability to be more attack in melee and extra shooting buffs or if you yeah or you know it's either either so wow there's there is so much to talk about here but i'm really unsure whether i'm going to have to really think about this and then come back at a later date and see what this all means we don't really know a lot we still don't know how much it costs these things are so obviously gas gold's gonna be up there in price 
maybe not over costed but you know maybe fair but obviously for a, for, a, for a larger army say 2,000 points so depending on whether you've got a war boss or a speed boss dictates which of these you can call you can only call it once so you've got to get all your eggs in one basket and so it's really going to come down to the build and how you like how you like to go i i favor trucks at the moment um but i do also favor a shooty style so maybe i've got to bring a get a war boss back a war boss on pipe back if that's still a thing in the new codex but it looks like that the death killer war trike is still going to be a thing i've got one of those maybe they might be worth it because they're compared to a, a war boss on a bike at the moment in this current edition they are better than the than the war trike maybe things have changed who knows we still don't know enough there's we can speculate this um but this is really exciting i do like the i used to love being able to call a while once a turn and doing that i always try to get it done by by second turn i used to believe that if i if i wasn't in fighting if i wasn't charging and having a melee attack by second turn then i wasn't playing orcs the way i thought and i'm a little bit sad that eight hasn't really provided me with that opportunity maybe nine will oh i'm excited i am really really excited about this this is fun really fun so what do you guys think about about these options do you like it do you hate it are you is you gonna be have you not got gas goal i don't have the gas goal model but i do have brass goal does that mean if you use gas goal you have to take just goths can gas goal be with other clans or subcultures unfortunately right now we don't know do you like the rules which wa do you favor are you going to be a wa a speed wa or a great wa put your comments below let's have a conversation okay thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed that if you did please like subscribe and share do all the algorithmic things and if you would like to help me out financially uh, there's always a buy me a coffee and patreon the links are in the description Okay, trying to toddle off. So, remember, if you go on crumping, you've got to bash early and bash often.